so in this figure we have a rectangle whose diagonal given is 10 cm and area is 48 cm square we have to find the sides also remember that this is not true to scale and just for representation we know in a rectangle opposite sides are equal and the angles are of 90 degree so this is a 90 degree angle let this be a rectangle a b c d that means a b is equal to c d and a c is equal to b d now if you focus on this image then here a c d is a right angle triangle with angle a c d is the angle 90 degree so this is a right angle triangle given area is 48 centimeter square area of a rectangle is equal to length into breadth here length is c d so let c d be x and a c be y so a c is equal to b d is x and a b is equal to c d is y area of a triangle will be x into y that means 48 centimeter square is equal to x y or from here we can take the value of y y is equal to 48 upon x now if we take this right angle triangle a c d so as per the pythagorean theorem square of the hypotenuse is equal to the sum of the squares of the two opposite sides so here hypotenuse is ad that means ad square is equal to ac square plus bd square ad given here is 10 so 10 square ac square is x square plus y square or 10 square is 100 x square plus y square we can put the value of y from equation 1 that is 48 upon x let this be equation 1 so y square is equal to 48 upon x whole square or 100 is equal to x square plus 48 square upon x square multiply x square to both the sides then it will be 100 x square is equal to x square parenthesis x square plus 48 square upon x square or 100 x square is equal to x to the power 4 plus cancel this x square in x square then it is 48 square or we send 100 x square to the right hand side or make this a quadratic equation x to the power 4 minus 100 x square plus 48 square is equal to 0 or x to the power 4 minus 100 x square plus 48 square is 2304 is equal to 0. Now we can factorize this. We have to find two numbers whose product is equal to 2304 and whose sum or difference should be equal to 100. Now 2304 is the product of 48 times 48. 48 we can write 16 times 3. 16 times 3. 16 is 4 times 4. This is also 4 times 4 times 3. Now 4 times 4 16 times 4 is 64. And then 3 times 4 12 12 times 3 is 36. So 64 times 36 will be equal to 2304 and 64 plus 36 will be 100 so we got our two numbers 64 and 36 using these two numbers we can factorize so we can write x to the power 4 minus 64 x square minus 36 x square plus 2304 is equal to 0 or x to the power 2 let take it common then x square minus 64 then minus 36 x square minus 64 is equal to 0 now x square minus 64 is common factor so x square minus 64 times x square minus 36 is equal to 0 now we have two values of x 
when x square minus 64 is equal to 0 then x square is equal to 64 or x is equal to square root of 64 or x is equal to plus minus 8 but x is the side so it cannot be negative so x is equal to 8 when x square minus 36 is equal to 0 x square is equal to 36 or x is equal to 36 under square root or x is equal to 6. So we have two values for x, x is equal to 8 and x is equal to 6. Now x here is AC, x here is CD, area given is 48 centimeter square. So here we can find the value of y, area of a rectangle given x times y is equal to 48 centimeter square when say when x is equal to 8 then y is equal to 8 times y is equal to 48 y is equal to 48 upon 8 so 8 times 6 is 48 y is equal to 6 again when x is equal to 6 then y is equal to 8 so these are the two sides of the rectangle 6 cm and 8 cm we can verify the diagonal given is 10 cm or the hypotenuse of the right angle triangle is 10 10 cm square so 10 square should be equal to 6 square plus 8 square some of the squares of the opposite two sides of the right angle triangle 10 square is 100 6 square is 36 and 8 square is 64 100 is equal to 100 LHS is equal to RHS. Answer is verified.